Good morning, Goal Getters. It is Friday. Happy Friday. Free Stuff Friday. So check out the page later tonight. You might win some more free stuff. It's going to be awesome. But today I want to talk about loss aversion. Loss aversion. So it is a term that is in behavioral psychology that says you will do more to avoid losing something than you will do to gain the something. So essentially, to make it super simple, uh, you will do more to avoid losing $20 than you would do work to gain $20 or fitness goals or financial goals. Uh, and so think about that in your life. Think about things where you are mo more motivated to show up to avoid something, avoid a negative consequence, than you are willing to do the work to obtain a positive consequence, right? So what does that have to do with us? What does that have to do with your goals? Because a lot of times when you're setting goals, your life is just, I mean, you, you're, you've been really comfortable being exactly the way you are. And if you're setting a goal that you wanna do something more different, uh, change, you know, that is kind of the other side of the loss aversion. You are trying to work for something to gain, but it's not nearly as mot motivating as it would be to avoid losing something. So here we are, Free Stuff Friday. It's the end of our two weeks. We we're, we're, did this two-week challenge. For you, it went how it went. Maybe it went great. Maybe you had some wins and some things that didn't work. That's all part of the journey. But my hope is that you continue. We are going to have a group that continues and, and that goes forward. And I wanted to dive into you to help you develop systems and structures in your environment that has you fulfill on your goals. Because if you're having a willpower through it, it's just like that, that loss aversion stuff. You're not going to show up to do something uh, just to do it, right? Like it's not going to work long term. You're going to have a weak moment. You're going to have a bad week. You're going to fall off a week. And then all of a sudden you're going to be like, ah, missed it again. Okay. So. In this next group, we are going to set up some things that one, not only has you do what you want to do, you know, go forward, but also has you avoid the not doing it. So we are going to set up some systems and some, some awesome, really amazing things that it's actually going to hurt a little bit more to not fulfill on your goals than it would be just to do the work. And the goal of that is to get you to do it long enough where the, you start to see the results from the new positive behavior. So one, you want to avoid something so it's just easier to show up and do the new thing. And then you do the new thing long enough where you start to see the benefits and the impact and the, all the fun about it. And then it flips, it's turned, it's almost like you start to, like you've been walking uphill, you're oh, this is so tough. And then all of a sudden, something you start to get some momentum and it feels like you're going downhill on your goals and you want to keep doing it. All right, so uh, think about the concept of loss aversion in your own life. Uh, does that ring true for you? Like if you're really being authentic, do you avoid, uh, do you avoid things? Is that more motivating than to obtain things? And then... Uh, if you would want to keep the group going and get invited to the next group, let me know because I'm excited to check in and keep crushing it with all you goal getters. So I know I'm a little bit behind on prizes. My goal, if you've won a prize, one, you might win some more or if you haven't won, you might win something tonight. Uh, but I want to get everything delivered and in your hands and, or if you have an appointment, get it scheduled by this weekend. So I'm caught up on that. And uh, it has just been my absolute pleasure to be a part of this group, watching you guys crush your goals, watching this community come together uh, on the concept around bring the good. So it's not the end. We're just, it's just a checkpoint. It's not an end point, but congratulations on, you know, making it through week two. And we're going to have one more weekend left and then we're going to just transition into the next group and keep going. So you guys have an amazing day. Happy Friday. Talk to you soon. Thanks.